Hello Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I'm going to be taking a look at what is manifesting for you at this moment. What is going on in your current situation with you and the person that is on your mind? Okay, so whenever you come across this reading, will be the right time for you to see it. And as always, take what resonates and leave out the rest. If by the end of this reading, you're still needing some more messages or confirmation, you can always take a look at your other placements. And if you are interested in a reading done by myself, all of that information I will leave in the description box below for you all. Okay. All right, Cancer, I'm seeing that what is passing you here? You, I'm hearing escape, escaping. There's a decision that you made in order to make some sort of movement for yourself here. Something had to come to an end in order for you to grow. I'm getting that in the past there was someone who where things started to develop with. There was a lot of passion between you and this person. And it's like you tried to save them. Someone was trying to save the other person from something. Um travel you two travel towards each other to see each other someone was coming or you are you had to go come to that person they had to come to you here but ultimately i'm getting that in the past you may have felt like this was a soulmate a soul connection this was a partnership or you've made an agreement with them soul contract but you have stopped trying to create something with this person you didn't see the potential anymore you didn't feel that spark anymore or that chemistry i'm saying that you wanted to see what was on the other side of this ending you're interested in something else the way that you see this person seven of coins reverse you see this person as Something isn't working out. No rewards. Hard work, no rewards. No longer investing. No longer, um, some, no, yeah, no longer investing emotionally, being emotionally unavailable. Let's take a look at you right now. I'm seeing you're feeling stuck. There's this moment where you're trying to navigate a situation towards starting over for yourself, um, making a journey towards a new destination. The conflict has ended. And now I see you feeling... Like you're second guessing, moving on. We have an engagement ring, engagement, partnership, commitment, eternity, completion, union. So you could have been engaged or you're currently engaged. There's Or this was a relationship leading towards that partnership. You saw something long term with this person. So now I see you kind of second guessing things. Like, should I... Should I really walk away? Yeah, I see you wanting to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation. Telling this person how you've been feeling. 
you're having a hard time moving on from what's happened even though there's there's no more conflict but I see you trying to give some sort of love offer towards this person but you're still wanting to stay guarded still wanting to have boundaries around yourself to protect yourself here but you're wanting to follow your heart and you're wanting to follow um yeah, you're wanting to follow your heart instead of your head. But the way that you see this person is as Ten of Coins reverse judgment upright. Losing stability within, maybe even losing friends, losing family members, going through an epiphany moment, judgment call, wake up call, a sudden realization about an ending not only not only did they lose you but other people as well in the picture I'm seeing this person feeling like this is a challenge outnumbered attacked Okay. But they want to they want to fight for this. There's been a breakup, a separation. They want to stop a pattern. There's been silent treatment or abandonment. They feel like, you know, there's the odds are against them, but they still want to fight for this. They want a relationship with you. They want a commitment with you, an engagement or leading up to marriage. This is what they're interested in. So they want to communicate. They're going to end up coming to see you. Page of Wands. They want to come see you. They want to have a face-to-face -face conversation. They're feeling excited again. They're feeling a spark or feeling interested in, in fighting for this. They're seeing you as collaborating or trying to work something out. Growing status. I see a love call. Someone expresses love, a message of love, thinking of you and letting you know. So there is communication coming in very, very soon. Knight of Swords. This is coming in fast. Um, there's a lot that you have to say. And I see you feeling... I'm hearing challenged. There's something that makes you feel challenged. Communication, honest communication that makes you feel very confident and like you're getting some, you're getting attention, the attention that you've been wanting. I see you wanting to give this another chance, judgment, but also you're making a judgment call, you're seeing what needs to change but at the same time at the same time things are not growing there's catching someone in a lie you catch someone in a lie and you feel very passionate about getting your point across. So there's stagnation. Things stop growing. Through this love call or conversation you end up having, it's like you catch someone in a lie. So you see this person as being confused or um, having other options. You may feel like you're an option to them. In your outcome, we have passion. Insane chemistry, like each other equally, having fun. There's someone in your outcome, could be a Capricorn, a Virgo, or a Taurus. We have Queen of Coins, but I'm seeing that you 
there's someone who you have a lot of chemistry with. Someone else. That you see this person as being slow, moving very slow towards you, or being cautious or guarded, but you're trying to take the lead here. Authority. I see success for you. Stability with your finances. I'm seeing you receiving success. You could be getting to a point of a leadership position, manager, something high up with this emperor. Regaining your power back. But you're uh, abandoning a situation, abandoning ship. And moving towards a new passion, a new flame. So let's get some details on specifics for you. You have occupation. In your past, I see that you've been working a lot on your occupation, hobby, or even you could be an entrepreneur. Ooh, didn't I say you have sudden wealth, stability, to the point where you are turning into this emperor. You know that saying, um, be the rich man that your parents always wanted you to marry? It's like, that's what I'm seeing, sudden wealth security stability off of something that you feel very passionate about some something that you've been working on in the past leads you to sudden wealth right now i'm seeing there's someone who you have a lot of love for lovers a relationship engagement there's a choice that you're trying to make here but you feel a lot of love and you're feeling pulled towards this person so we do have the numbers 34, 15, and 11. Let's see what Spirit wants you to know right now. You could be in a relationship and you two are just not speaking at this moment. But there's communication coming in. This spirit want cancer to know right now. What should cancer know right now? It's time to take action. It's time to speak what's on your mind. I'm hearing say what's on your mind. Be honest. But also don't be reckless. Your hard work is paying off. Your hard work is paying off when it comes to your work, when you're working on your, your your business. Or if you work in corporate, people are noticing you. and They notice your hard work. They see that you're really hardworking. You're dedicated. You're focused. Recognized. You're being recognized. Um, you're moving into a time for healing. So a time to take a pause, a time to rest. At the bottom of the deck, we have communication is key. So there is communication coming in. Again, be assertive, but don't be reckless is what I'm hearing, or vice versa. New Moon and Gemini. Could be dealing with a Gemini. I'm seeing a Capricorn and Aries here. So with that being said, this is what I'm seeing. If it resonated, let me know in the comment section down below. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. Hi.